So anyways, we went through that flow and we ended up with an overall more efficient, faster to develop, easier to understand framework. And that is the process that we're going to continue to follow. I'm going to continue adding more test cases to the framework. I'm going to continue refactoring things. And I'm going to keep doing this over and over in small, tiny increments, guys. Small, tiny increments. I can't emphasize that enough. You guys saw the lesson of how a function that we just developed failed the next deployment. So it happens a lot. So be ready for it. So if you develop in small increments, it will make it that much easier to fix everything. And you won't waste as much time developing something that's going to break later. It's a big lesson, especially for all you beginners. Just learn it and do it. Trust me. It's, I spent years doing this and take my pain and suffering and just learn from it. And so that was the development of the framework. And from this point on, we will continue to progress through the frameworks. I will teach you guys the new and super advanced test-driven framework that crushes the heck out of the keyword-driven framework in all aspects. And it's the new revolutionary thing to do in QTP and UFT. And I have not seen many individuals use it yet, but I've been using it at my job so successfully that I know it's a big hit and I know it's much better than the keyword driven framework. Now, the keyword driven framework does have its place in the automated testing industry and we can discuss that more in the future, but the test driven framework is also great for its own purposes. And for my purpose of developing automated tests as fast as possible without having to worry about other people, the test-driven framework is the solution for me. And so in future courses, I will teach you guys a test-driven framework. We will develop it from scratch to finish. You will get to see all the code. You will get to learn everything as it happens in real time. And you guys, as always, feel free to ask questions. Feel free to bother us. We are here to assist you. We are not a tutorial that just teaches without listening. We listen to our people. We listen to your advice because our goal is to make your learning better. And when you complain, when you give advice, that's when we can make everything better. So anyways, thank you guys for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed the lesson. Hope you enjoyed everything that went on here and see you guys in the next tutorials. Keep up the great work. Take care.